Hey everyone, this is Ledbetter17P. Today we have a little bit of a tutorial video on how to upgrade your uh, Joytech Cuboid 150 watt vape device to a 200 watt vape device, which is pretty simple. Uh, I'm pretty sure everyone can figure it out, but I'm still going to show you guys how to do it. So first off, what you need to do is go to this website right here which is the Joytech website. It's joytech.com forward slash MVR dash software. And you will see all these uh, most recent downloads right here. Basically what you want to do is click on the one that says firmware version 3.10 to upgrade cuboid. Go ahead and click on that. That will bring you to this page right here. Uh, what I'll probably do is just put a link directly to this page on uh, in the description to the video below for you guys. Uh, this is the firmware upgrade for the cuboid to upgrade it from 150 watt to a 200 watt temp control device. So basically all you gotta do is click the download over here for either Windows or Mac, for whichever one you're on. Uh, once you have that all set, you go ahead and download it. Uh, and then you just save the file and so forth. I already have it saved, so we don't need to upgrade it or don't need to re-download it. So let's go minimize that page. This is what you will see inside the uh, folder. Uh, a bunch of bin files and an update firmware uh, application. So what you want to do is double click that uh, up there, update firmware uh, file. And this is what you will see. Once you have this window open, take your USB cable that was supplied with your cuboid and go ahead and plug in your cuboid so let me plug mine in right now there we go it will recognize the mod right here it says device name cuboid uh, firmware version 3.10 hardware version 1 so as you can see i already have mine upgraded at the moment but basically what you want to do yours will say hardware version 3.00 or firmware version 3.00 hardware version 1 so what you want to do is click update. Once it uh, pops this window up, basically all you want to do is select the cuboid version 3.10 bin. Go ahead and open it. And there you go. It will do its update for you. It says firmware update complete. Just click OK. And then you can go ahead and exit out of this program and your cuboid will now be a 200 watt device. So hopefully this does help you guys out. Uh, I will put the link for this website right here uh, for the download in the description below for you guys so you guys can check it out. Uh, so hope you enjoyed this video. If so, click the like button down below. Leave a comment in the comment section with any questions or concerns, and I'll do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. Uh, don't forget to check out ledbetter17p.net for downloads, game videos, tech videos, and vape reviews. Uh, there is a donation button on the front page. That donation button is there to uh, help you guys donate towards vape giveaways here on the YouTube channel. Other than that, don't forget to share and subscribe. So until next time, this is Leadbetter17P. Thanks for watching.